little sing, little high pitch oh, to her, right? Get it changed out. Get out of here. Last call of the day. Fujitsu! Fujitsu! Low as you can cut them. Fujitsu! Fujitsu! <laughs> That's it right there. That's it. Alright guys, I am on a repair call. I am going to be working on a Fujitsu split heat pump today. And I am going to be putting on a, a condensing fan motor out at the condenser. The bearings are uh, really bad on it. They're still running, but it's singing, boy. It's singing. That high pitch tone, you know what I'm saying? So I'm going to roll up here and, uh, and replace this motor. Alright guys, rolling up to the job now. That's us over there, I believe, guys. That's us right there. Right there, the bedroom unit. <laughs> uh, I don't need to get off on the grass. y'all can hear it can't you yes sir. yep got a little little sing a little high pitch oh, to her right so we're going to take care of this place this motor first thing we got to do is get this panel off and I'm gonna have to take it apart a little bit. Uh, gotta get in here and take the top off and take this panel here off in order to uncover the condensing fan motor. Okay guys so we took the top off okay which exposed that then on the end we took the fan cover panel off and I also pulled the top part that goes here to this board. So now this is what we're looking at. All right. Now this is what we're looking at, y'all. Like we got a motor mount there, there. Uh, there. And one more. I think it's four total motor mounts in there. So see, yep. One, two, three, four. We'll get that motor pulled out and off and move on to the next step. All right, guys, and following the power wires right here, where it goes up in the back, you see how it kind of goes in there, comes across through this channel, comes down and in through here. Took this screw out right which allows us to be able to remove this set it to the side and uh, this right here to that plug there that is the power where it plugs on to the board okay got to locate that too right so now it's located okay guys I have put a little WD-40 on the center of our nut right here on the fan blade right the fan blade y'all can see that to give it a little make it a little easier to get this thing off and if you can see here it actually tells you to unfasten so it's righty loosey lefty tighty uh to get this blade off so you just come down here and make sure you get a nut dress 5 16 the bit or what you're going to need is 5 16 in diameter. You need something with a hollow shaft. Alright. And I, you know how I am. Uh, I like using my, my 6 and 1. But, you know, as you can see, the 6 and 1, it ain't hollow. It ain't hollow. So, you can't get in there with that. So, unfortunately, we 
we've got to go with with a hollow shaft because we've got the threads that's the threads just got a little bit of length to it okay and we'll just come in here like so and to the right to loosen up And for God's sake, don't lose the nut. Okay. And then just pull the pull it off. Just that simple. Okay. Now it exposes our motor and we can we can uh, get down to business and take our motor mounts out. And remove this bad boy. Get it changed out. Get out of here. Last call of the day. Fujitsu! Old motor on the left. New motor on the right. Y'all listen to this. New motor. A lot better, right, guys? A lot better than this shit. <laughs> Alright, guys, let's get this thing in here. Got the new motor in there. Wow. No noise. Got the motor mounts in there. Boom, boom. It's time to put the blade on there. Got the blade on there. Okay, got that tight. All right, next step, put the panels back on, yeah. Okay. Let's make this thing come on and run. Go see if our fan motor was a success install. Okay, guys, I got all the panels back on, motor installed, blade back on, motor hooked up, all that good stuff. And I made it tall, I cut it down low as you can cut them. Fujitsu! And uh, put it down on uh, 64. So, any noise that's being heard right now that's getting picked up on my mic is going to be from the compressor because it is wide open. You know what I'm saying? I crunk it down low as I could crank it. So, but there is, if y'all, I'm going to put, the, put it down here where y'all can hear. There's no fan motor noise from the bearings because we have changed the motor. Nothing from the fan, y'all. That fan is running smooth. Now, our compressor in here, we got it raising hell because, I, like I said, this is probably about 95 degrees out here. And uh, I cut it down really, really, really low, low as I could get it, just so it would run for me. And uh, no more squealing bearings. All right, guys, that's another one in the bag. Done. Fujitsu! Okay, guys, I just got done with that Fujitsu mini split, okay, and yeah, we do put a lot of Fujitsu's in, that's what's on my shirt, Fujitsu, that is, we are an elite dealer, so we do put a lot of the Fujitsu's in, and uh, one thing about me is I do love my Japanese anime, mm, I love it, don't get me started with it. All the other references that were made to Fujitsu, uh, with Fujitsu being a Japanese uh, heating and air uh, equipment company, I don't feel like I fully gave the name justice. So let me try it one more time uh, in 
the sound of what they would actually be making in the Japanese anime, right? You know? Uh, <laughs> That's it right there. That's it. <laughs>